Yo, hello everyone! Do you want to enhance your Wix website in 2023? Discover 5 expert tips and tricks that will elevate your site design, functionality, and user experience. So, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So guys, to start up and kick up with this video, we are going to start actually with this article from the Wix blog itself. So here, as you can see, it is obviously here 10 web design secrets for a knockout Wix website. So here you will have all the basic stuff that you have to get inside of your website in case you'd like it to be really attractive and enhance the like the experience of the visitor so let's start with the first step that works themselves are giving us which is not your site layout so your site layout is the foundation of the entire design team understanding your layout will help you determine many of the crucial decisions that you'll make as you build your website when you are considering how to structure your layout think about how you want to divide your site into content section so this is simply what do they mean with that when you are actually placing stuff on your website when you are putting articles or putting pictures you should have already a big picture on your website and how it must look like as an example here I'm going to open paint so I can show you an example so here we are in this is our website now let's say that you have here the menu so which is obviously here you have like a big banner with an image into it and then you will start designing the website first of all you will need to have an idea on how many sections you will divide your website for so here we have the first section which is the header of the page the header and the menu all right it is good now for the footer we are going to leave its section clear for us so we are not going to touch these things so we have here the gallery like the header the menu and then here the footer so here what we should go for is to divide our website on three to four sections so this is one I'm going to copy it and then like keep pasting it and all of them must be on the same scale and size as you can see here so here you will be left with two kind of triangles so make sure to like play with these two until you make the that into like these three main triangles and make it a fourth triangle for example and make the footer shorter so we can make like the footer like that and this will just be a normal triangle so like that we have five or six sections so we have here like the first one the header here the footer and here section number one four and five and here the sixth one so here we have six kind of uh like sections and each section will have its own layout its own design and from that we'll start decorating and managing the layout of our website so that what they mean with that the second thing which is customize your site color to match your site's vibe so let's say that you have like first of all we are going to the same example that will be here so here we have for example a logo in black so let's get for example like png as an example so here we have this blackish nike uh design so i'm going to put it here don't save so this is the design that we have of nike it is black so the website that you are going to work on it shall have black uh like right here which is the font and of course it has to have a white background why because instead of a white background if you use a darker background we will not be able to see the logo and let's take an example of the nike official website let's check it out and as you may see here they have an actual white background going to gray a little bit and as you can see here they are dividing their website as well to three sections which is the header this section and then these two sections different sections and finally here like this download section and the footer 
so this is like the main thing to go for and as you can see here they are going for similar colors simple colors which is the thing that they have said here and of course you can simply to find like the good colors for the for example let's say that you have colors in your logo which is in red and you are wondering what colors are going to fit red the best you can just search for uh, colors palettes and here you can find really good grading colors you can search here for red and as an example here you will find all of these different colors make sure to find the correct red that you have on your logo and then find it over here you can literally just paste the code here and you will find all the different palettes that you can work using that specific color that you have on your logo so this is the second tip that works giving you here the third tip which is beautify your page with scrolling effects so once you are going through your website you don't really want it to be um, simple like that you want to have some moving images something like that so if you're really into that, you can, for example, go and learn 3GS. So for example, here we can get some examples over here, for example, this one. So this website is really good. So let me just show you how this, everything is actually moving here. We can click, we can hear everything is animated. We can scroll here. Um, if you scroll in here, as you can see, the text has been selected, as you may notice here. Um, so these things can actually give you a lot of advantage and makes your website look more beautiful than it usually does. So this is the third tip that works are actually given you fourth which is upload your own fonts so works doesn't come with all fonts that are available on the net and of course you might have some specific fonts that you really like and they look much more professional than the ones that fonts uh, that the works fonts actually provides for you so what you have to do in that case specifically you can match your logo fonts so here for example as we have nike fonts we are going to use the same font or something familiar similar or simple so here as you can see the font is nothing amazing it's just like like a normal font that you can find anywhere and it is really doing the job you don't really have to do something really fantastic and luxurious anything can do the work as long as it is readable and attracting the eye so stuff like that for example the menu can make it small and stuff like that as a title you have to make it big and the same font that are, they are using here they are using on their posters so that's what the big companies are doing so why don't you do it as well because this is like the good thing to do and finally here the fifth uh, information that they are given add professional photos from big stock or any stock uh, like pixel uh, free stocks anything that's actually giving you a high quality images you don't really have to go for example to google and get images from google because most of the images have licenses they will copyright you and etc and otherwise if you search for pixels for example they really have insane amount of good quality pictures that you can get for free and at the same time there's videos and etc so everything here are is really fantastically good so yeah guys these are the five tips on how to get your wix website enhanced thanks a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial